Hi, my name is Simon, and uh, I am an AR-15 enjoyer. And because of that, I found something in Tarkov, booting up the game for the first time after wipe, that I thought that it's worth sharing. That is actually that specifically the ADAR, which is also an AR-15. Um, you can actually get it on day one, being level one, on wipe. You just have to buy every part for it and assemble it yourself. So go to skier and then buy the ADAR components in here. Like I'm doing right now. All of this. Slap it all in together here. There we go. Gonna bang out here again. Go to the menu. Sorry for the stash issue here. Um, it's wipe day, so stash is messy. Alright, assemble the thing here. Like that. The gun still doesn't work because we are lacking two parts. Actually three, but for making it actually be able to shoot, we need two more parts. So First, we're going to go into Ski again, and we're going to buy a Muscle Break right here. We're going to go into Peacekeeper, and over here, we can then find the Gas Block right here. And lastly, we need a Charging Handle. Where's that thing? Oh, that's also Ski. Right there. Buy that. So have all this together, like so. Now, we need a Scope for it, and you can either go for this one, the Walter, um, from Skier, and if you have unlocked Jaeger, then I highly recommend going for the Cobra, this one. Buy that. You also have another option, a bit more expensive. That's going to be Peacekeeper, and in here you can buy the Burris Fast Fire 3. Um, I like this one a lot, but it is, it do tend to be a bit expensive on wipe days to use. So, therefore I'm just sticking with the Cobra here. Slap it on, and then we also need the magazines for it. You also can get here on Peacekeeper, right there. And ammunition, when you're level 1 and up until level 14, secret incoming, then you're most likely just going to be using the 856. Now, let's check the stats for it. For that, I'm using an app called Battle, Battle Body. You can highly recommend it. It's really, really good. See? Ammunition. And then in the here, we can then go and find... M856. Right here. And for the stats of it, it comes with penetration of 23, and damage of 59, and frag chance of 32, velocity 874. I'd say that's honestly pretty good on being a low level running that ammunition. Now, when you hit level 14, then on Peacekeeper, you open him up. And you will be able to buy 856A1, which is going to be massive. This this round right here can carry you through all the mid of Tarkov. Hey, it can even carry you in in-game of Tarkov, to be honest. So let's go check the stats in this round, shall we? Using the app again, Battle Body. And for the 56A1s, it's going to come with a penetration of 37, damage of 54, Frag chance of 32, and a velocity of 940. You can use this round for sniping, you can do tap taps with it. It's, a, it's massive. You can buy 150 per reset, so therefore I recommend whenever you get to 14, unlock Peacekeeper ASAP, and just buy these rounds whenever he does the restock, because it's gonna help you so much in the early days of Tarkov, trust me. Another thing to take note of is, when you reach level 2 on Peacekeeper, is you can change the gas block. Because if you take this gun up on me, give me a second here, here we go, and then we're gonna slap Max in here and go to the hideout. Try out the gun. Here we are. So you see, you can see those pointers in the front from the iron side, right? That is from the gas plug. I'd say it's still useful, like, it's not because it's obscuring your vision, it's just there, it can be a bit annoying, but. Again, when you reach level 2 on Peacekeeper, you can change that thing. Going into him again. Hit level 2, and then you can get this gas block instead. Buy it, and slap that on instead. Oh. Nice. Clean. Pretty clean. Now, if you want a scope for the gun, there's also an option for that. And that is by using Jaeger. So, on Jaeger, you can then go and buy... A 22 millimeter ring mount. Can't see it here in a second. There we go. Right there. Buy that thing. And then buy <clears throat> the bombs pilot. 
slap that into it. And put it on. No, we actually got the sniper out of the thing. Just by having Jaeger available as well. For getting the skill. Yeah, there we go. Before we end it here, let's just take it into the shooting range and I'll pop some shots down there so you can actually see the performance of the gun. Now, let's just try and really remove the night vision here and remove the black and white here as well because I just did a night vision run. Actually, I went in on night raid without night vision and I killed the duo with night vision. So, hey, victory success for me. <laughs> All right, here we go. It is split fast on it and crouched. works yeah all right hope you like it take care until next time good luck